Perhaps, like the many, you are in search of light. You sense the world dimming. More rainy days, more starless nights. It seems the moon has stopped strong-arming the clouds, has stopped reaching through it all for you. The collective energy of humanity may feel heavy, tired, without vibration. So I join you today on an expedition for light. You see, I believe that though current circumstances have dropped heavy velvet theater curtains around us, the light is still there, burning thriving. It is in places we cannot see in the midst of so much pain and fear and worry. But I believe together we can put our hands in the ashes of spent light and kindle it into something new. Something that will feed and serve more than ourselves. So let's begin. Take a deep breath and listen. What is moving and working around you? What good is inside your room or outside your window? Imagine the sounds you hear are not traffic or birds or laughter or wind, but drum beats, the backbeat to your life today. What is the rhythm? Feel its beat. and allow the primal drums of life still moving ahead to awaken all your senses. Rouse your heart from its anesthesia. Breathe deep. Here in this place of drumming, Look for a flicker, here, there, out of the corner of your eye, out of the corner of your heart. See the flicker, find the light, and watch its burn. Notice the color of the light the texture, the brightness. Focus more on the feeling of the light than what it looks like. No matter its magnitude, this light is energy. This light instantly brightens its space. If it's not already there, place the light inside you and notice. Watch it fill you completely. Your face lighting up. Traveling down your arms. down your back, down your chest. Feel the light travel down your legs, and notice its pulse 
in the bottoms of your feet. Feel the warmth it offers. Allow yourself to bask, to let go, to glow. Breathe. As you relax and enjoy the light within, feel the energy of it. like the drum beat. Quickening its pace. Awakening you even more to this day, to this world, to your dreams and your purpose. Listen to yourself without analyzing and without thinking. Feel. Let hope bubble up inside you with all its evanescence and joy. Breathe. Viktor Frankl, who survived the Holocaust, once declared, what is to give light must endure burning. What is to give light must endure burning. So many are burning, turning to ash around us. We are rekindling the flames sometimes our own flames. May we be present to the feeling of ash in our hands and the feeling of fire within. May we use our own struggle and the light it produces for others for a greater good. May we continue the search for more light. May we kindle it and give it to the world. <laughs>